Je ne peux penser qu'à Je ne peux penser qu'à Je ne peux penser qu'à toi Je ne peux penser qu'à toi Hi So Yan na nga I got my products from Lazada I got them online And I got it here So the one yung package today I ordered it around two nights ago, and you can expect na darating siya today. I've seen that for sure kayo din on YouTube, everywhere. Everyone's just talking about it. Ito na yung package, and let's open it. So, they have two stores, again. I'm sure you guys know this, but I just want to make kwento a little bit. They have two stores in UP Town Center and in Glorieta. Both of those places are not easily accessible to me. So, hindi ko talaga na isipang pumunta doon. Actually, pregisip ako na very slight. But, I don't know. Just looking at this na... Wow. Ang cute! Guys, this is so cute. Wait lang. Sorry. Even from Lazada, maganito silang pa-package. That's really nice. So, Yun nga, nakikita ko on Instagram stories na ang haba ng pila, like, always, every day. Tapos may limited pa na numbers kung alam lang yung pwede mong pilin and stuff like that. So, medyo hassle, di ba? <laughs> ang layo pa niya. Plus, I'm pregnant. So, I don't think kakayanin ko and it's healthy for me to make pila, make pila, na pumila for 2 hours for, you know, lipsticks. Para na sa, naka-seal talaga siya. So, ayun. Hintay ko na lang siya na maging available online. And they're always sold out. As in, nung nag-release sila, hindi pa nag-work yung website. I'm sure you guys know. Parang, for me, it kind of ruined it. Parang, ang problematic naman ng brand na to. No? Laging may problema. Tapos, laging parang out of stock always and stuff like that. Sabi ko, I'll just wait for people to like get over it. Pero mag isang bon na and people are still in it. Grabe, hirap niyong buksan. Sabi ko, ayun. Tapos hindi na ako nga nagpa-plan na bumili. Pero one night, which was two nights ago, I accidentally clicked my Lazada app on my phone. I just opened it accidentally. As in, ko talaga sinasadya. And then, since I was there in the app, Anyway, so I said, okay, browse ako ng konti. And then, sa search history ko, and you click the search, bar. Lalabas kasi doon yung mga recently search parang keywords mo. Lumabas yung fluff mats. So, sabi ko, okay, uh, why not? So, check out ko lang. And this bundle was available. Kasi nakalagay doon was add to cart. But I checked it earlier. It's already add to wish list. So, I assume ubus na siya. And all the other, lahat, as in lahat ng minibendo na nasa Lazada, also on their website, is already sold out. So, I think I got lucky because I don't know, balak bumili din nung gabi yun. Pero, I had the option to add it to cart. So, available siya nung night na yun. So, anyways. OMG, ang cute! And it's the jelly pouch. And then it comes with the three uh, shades of lipsticks. So, if you guys are wondering, I got these for 1,000 200 pesos. So, kasama na itong tatlong lipsticks and this pouch. So, if you buy it individually, this is 345 pesos a piece and then this is 195 pesos. If you do the math, you save onti lang naman. You save a little bit of peso. I'm not gonna do the math kasi it's not about the math, you guys. It's about these lipsticks. On their website, it's not available. I don't know if they do this on their uh, stores also, but on Lazada, you can get this one. So, we got three shades. The bundle that I have comes with the jelly pop. Ulit, ulit tayo. Basta yun. The shades are hot sauce, baked, and milkshake, you guys. Ayan. Ito yung kanyang itsura. Sobrang obsessed ako. This uh, illustration reminds me of one of my favorite illustrations which is by Quib. Uh, it's an artist I found in Society6 and I've always loved them for years now. So, nakita ko to online. Sabi ko, oh my gosh, that reminds me so much of Quib. So, sabi ko, I dig it. 
Tapos, very aesthetically pleasing. It's so nice. So, ayun. I won't get into details with the packaging. Kasi, for sure, you guys know that naman na. <coughs> Excuse? Oh, pangit. <laughs> Pero, ayan. Oh, it's nice. Sobrang ganda niya. As in, para siyang mousse. Para siyang lipstick ka ba talaga, te? As in. Ganda. I've never seen anything na may gantong texture. So, wala siyang amoy. Anyways, I'm wearing lipstick right now. So, sabi ko nga, kapag ayos na ako. Kasi I'm going somewhere. Pero, tatanggalin natin yan. If you guys are wondering what lipstick I'm wearing, it's from L'Oreal in Mont Blanc. Ayan. Sobrang nice. Hindi ko kasi mga gantong kulay. Ayan. Pero L'Oreal, tabi-tabi. Hindi naman ako ang bida dito. <laughs> So, let's go with milkshake. Hello? Mm -hmm. Wow. Itong first impression ko. Wow. As in, I was thinking milkshake would be a little bit on the pink side. Pero sa skin tone ko, in person ha, I don't know kung ganun mag-reflect talaga siya sa video. Para siya medyo peachy na medyo orange, peachy, super onting pink lang as skin. Sobrang onte. Pero the finish makes it so pretty. I'm not into the color that much. But the finish, dude. And you know, actually, pag bigid na mo siya in like as a whole, na meron kasi ako dito, meron ako dito. Um, I like it. As in, parang mo, medyo, wow, medyo magkawig nga sila, guys. Pero the finish, wow, it's so nice. Ah, grabe. Okay, fine. Fine. The hype is real. It's, it's nice. As in, mukhang naging healthy yung lips ko. Nakawa ka dun. Because the color is so hot. I don't normally wear colors like this, so I'm so intrigued. This will be my first lipstick na I'm going to Wow! 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 This reminds me, it's a very earthy color. Pero, peg ko siya, like normally hindi. Kasi normally, I don't wear colors like this. Pero, grabe. Bet ko siya, as in. May gayuma ata itong lipstick na to, as in. Lakas mga social ng kulay. <laughs> Hindi ako na-excite sa kulay na to, kasi it's red. I already have my red lipstick, kasi dati talaga. Sobrang hilig ko sa lipstick. I hoard lipsticks talaga before. So, mating ako sa point na sabi ko, ang cluttered na. <laughs> So, I got rid of most of my lipsticks. As in, I just kept the ones na talagang gusto ko, talagang regularly sinusuot ko. And, pinamigay ko yung iba and threw out the others na hindi na ginagamit. Hindi mo kasi ako ma-red na type of girl. So, isa lang yung red lipstick ko kasi I feel ko enough na yun for me. So, if you guys are wondering, that is Ano pangalan na ito? It's Russian Red. I'm hoping na different uh, red siya. Hmm. What? Inis na ako! It's definitely different. This is on the orangey side. Wow, it's so nice. Kasi yung Russian Red, it has a bit of like... It's, on the, it's a little bit cool toned. Pareho silang parang I can be colors on their own different ways. Ayan. Sobrang grabe. Gulat ako dun. Parang this, I'm a fan of this lip color. So, my final verdict color payoff is so good. I know why it's really hype. Like, the hype, it's worth the hype. Puro hype, hype, hype. Aesthetically pleasing. Sobrang it's really nice. I don't regret them adding to my lipstick collection because I really choose my lipsticks wisely now when I buy them because I'm trying to like 
uh, avoid glitter so this one like all of these shades I can tell na madagamit ko talaga sila plus the pouch is spacious na review yung pouch hindi ko masyado nag-expect sa longevity niya longevity hindi ko nag-expect sa haba or how long it will last on my lips kasi it's just a bullet type lipstick even kay ano kay maring mac Diba? Transfer. Hindi sa transfer proof. Pero okay lang. Kasi it's a bullet lipstick. Diba? I watched tons of videos about uh, these lipsticks. Tapos, iba-ibang skin tones din yun. Iba-iba yung kulay. Kaya I had an expectation in my head. Sobrang iba. Lalo na kay milkshake and kay bake. Iba yung aura niya sa lips ko. And for the price, I think it's not really that bad. Paraben free and cruelty free. 345, I think sobrang sulit na niya. You can tell it's like a high-end lipstick yung ano niya, yung quality niya. Kasi nga, tulad dito kay Maring Mac, diba? It's 1,000 per bullet. Masakit sa loob bumili ng 1,000 peso lipstick. So, compare mo sa 345, hindi na masama. Tapos, ang ganda niya. As in, it's matte. The color selection is great. I think it's worth it, to be honest. Primo, 1,000 for this. Tapos, I paid 1,200 for three of these pasta pals. Sabihin na natin 1,000 for three lipsticks. Not bad. And it's not like you're sacrificing quality. Okay siya. As in, I think it's really worth it. It's just that I feel like hindi siya worth it ng ikastress. Sa pila ka for hours just to buy lipsticks or mas stress ka sa website nila when they're launching or releasing new stocks I don't think it's worth it na mas stress ka ng ganun for lipstick I'm not saying that the formula is not worth it or anything like that it's just in general diba? sobrang sinuelta lang ang mga rinyo na nahuli ko siya sa Lazada accidentally pa so thank you guys for watching I really appreciate it and i hope you guys liked this video if you did please do give me a thumbs up and yeah thank you guys for watching and i hope you have a nice day bye